okay so let's begin with this session this session that we are going to start with it's about the oracle sql and pl sql so the session that we are going to start with it's about the oracle sql and pl sql before we will start with this session oracle sql and pl sql it's about me like uh, my name is sandos and uh, i'm working as a technical specialist and it's more than 15 plus year of experience i have and especially with this oracle in my entire 15 years or more than that career i am using the oracle this particular session that we are going to start with it's about the oracle sql and pl sql try to understand suppose see oracle is a big thing like it's a it's a huge thing so many things are there in oracle mainly when i'm talking about the oracle at first you need to learn about sql and pl sql this sql and pl sql see you can learn the oracle from the developer point of view or you can learn the oracle from the dba point of view so what we are going to learn about we are going to learn the oracle from the developer point of view for the developer it's a different requirement for the dba it's a different requirement developer need to learn how to write sub bodies how need to write joins how we are going to create the procedure functions package or sort trigger so developer having the different requirement dba having the different requirement when i am talking about a developer what i call developer so after completion of this particular session you people can join as a oracle developer other than the oracle developer if you are looking for any programming you are going for the java you are going for the python you are looking for some different programming you are looking for the data science every time you people need to understand the concepts of the database and you need to implement that this particular session that we are going to start with it's about the oracle sql and pl sql it's a weekend session that we're going to start with so our session will be on only saturday and sunday if we are going to get some uh, like uh, so holidays like it was earlier it was uh, like yesterday it was 26 jan so it's going to be like holidays for us so we can have that session so normally it's going to be the weekend session it's on saturday and sunday and session is going to be of like one and half hour to two hours that depends on the requirement it might be two and half hours that depends on the requirement requirement means what sometime it's been like we are going to start with the individual topic see when i am going to take the session my agenda will be like we need to complete the particular topic yeah this is the boundary line. like we are we have the session from one and half hour to two hours but suppose one and half hour is more than enough so many things we are going to cover definitely you people need the time to do the practice so we are going to stop that session like we are not in hurry like we are just going to make the things complete at, like we are going to take the two hour session because we also need to think about it's not with the bouncer so this is will be the timing of the session the duration of the entire course will be it will take around two months it will take around two months to make it complete remember this oracle sql and pl sql i can make it complete in one day or two day or three days but the thing is that every technology deserves some respect you need to give some time technology is the kind of thing that we need to digest we cannot do like i am to take the four hour session or five hour session it's get completed at my end but again you people need to do the practice you need to give some extra time to do the practice and if you are going to do the practice and all everything is going to be fine the fee for this particular course that you people need to pay right now the offer is going on right now this offer is going on like uh, it's a republic day offer like every year i am going to launch this kind of offer so like some of the time it's happen like people having some problem and all so okay it's fine like uh, see as a technical people like it's not our agenda just to like if i am talking about myself it's not only my agenda like uh, i am taking all these lessons it's not to get the incomes and all 
remember we also need to transfer the knowledge we need to share the few things with you so that's why all these sessions are there so if people having some problem and all that's why always are going to launch this kind of session and it's going to be 50% off right now it's going to be 50% off so actual the fee is for this entire session is it's 7500 but after this you just need to pay the half of the amount like you need to pay 3750 that amount you need to pay this will be the amount that you need to pay only so after this like 50% uh, off the actual amount that you need to pay is 3750 after every session you people are going to get the recording plus notes will be there you are going to get the recording and you are going to get the notes after every session recording will be there notes will be there now i am talking about now you can ask me a question santos my name is santos huh. <laughs> so it might be you are going to ask me the question santos what is special about your session so many recordings are available with the youtube so many like notes or tutorials all these things are available with the internet why i am going to attend your session number one it's a live session we can discuss number one it's a live session we can discuss the problem if you have some problem you can share the screen with me i am going to solve that number two in this entire session what are the content that i am going to cover believe me you people are not going to get on the entire google so many things are there that i am going to cover and you people are not going to get the entire things in the entire google and entire youtube and that you are going to learn from very first or second session in every session the few things will be there that i am going to cover and that going to give you the advantage as for example as for example i am talking with you as for example suppose my question is in primary key can we put the duplicate values and you are going to give me the answer no in the primary key how we can put the duplicate values but i am going to show you how we can put the duplicate values in the primary key and why we are using this i am also going to explain you that suppose my question is we have the duplicate values can we apply the unique constant on that we have the duplicate values can we apply the primary key on it and i am going to tell you yes we can do that there is the option for that and wh why this scenario is there what is the requirement of that i am going to discuss with you in every particular topic i am telling you i am involved i am oracle certified professional i am oracle certified professional i am involved with this oracle it's around 20 years so in this particular session i am going to keep my entire 20 year experience i am going to share with you that's it so you don't need to worry about like about the problem real time or about the sub queries about the joints as a developer what are the things required over there we are going to learn each and everything and remember in every single session you are going to learn the unique thing that's rarely you are going to find it out in every session we are going to learn the few new things over here definitely like i cannot change the syntax i cannot change the concept join always join if you are going to open the google you are going to get the same answer but again in the join the few things are there that i am going to dis discuss with you that going to be the advantage for you so in the entire session we are going to learn about the sql as well as we are going to learn about the pl sql under this sql what we are going to learn about under this sql what we are going to learn about under the sql definitely we will start from the database basics so many times it's happened like people are saying no no santos i am very much familiar with the database basic but once you will attend the session then you will find it out what is missing once you will attend the session then you will figure it out what you people are missing 
so we are going to start it from the database basics then we are going to start the oracle installation and configuration that's also a challenge always how you are going to configure the oracle and then we are going to start with the command so first we are going to learn about the select statement so many things are there within the select statement after the select statement we are going to learn about the ddl dm tcl data definition language create alter drop rename truncate flashback purge dml data manipulation language insert update delete merge tcl transaction control language we are going to learn about the commit rollback save point after this we are going to start with the next chapter that will be the constraint we are going to learn about the primary key foreign key not null unique default all the constants and all after that we are going to learn about the row function we are going to learn about the analytical function we are going to learn about the ranking function after this we are going to start with one concept is there locking practically i am going to show you what exactly the deadlock is practically i am going to show you nothing is theoretical when the theoretical portion is required definitely it will be there but everything i am going to demonstrate in front of you it's a practical thing i am going to show you practically i am going to show you how the deadlock is going to occur in the condition of deadlock what happen how the oracle is going to handle that so we are going to learn about the locking after that we are going to learn about the joins we are going to learn about the set operators we have the different categories of the joins are there we have the sql 99 standard join and we have the oracle standard join in the sql 99 standard join we have the inner join left outer right outer full outer cross join natural join all we are going to under the oracle standard join we are going to learn about the eq join non eq join outer join self join so we are going to learn all the categories of the join and we are going to implement five table six table in the join panel and then we will try to apply the join we are going to learn about set operator after this we are going to learn about the sub queries we are going to learn about the sub queries we have the different types of sub queries are there single row sub queries multi row sub queries multiple column sub queries correlated sub queries we have the inline views everything we are going to learn after this entire session you people are not going to face any problem related with the join related the sub queries and all in every interview in the written test every time you are going to get the questions from there only after this we are going to learn about the indexing we are going to learn about the sequence we are going to learn about the views this is going to be the first part of the sql it's going to be end after this sql we are going to start with the pl sql portion under the pl sql portion at first we are going to learn about the basics of the programming every time when we are going to start any programming language we need to learn about the basics so we are just going to learn about the basics after that we are going to learn about the collection framework pl sql table nested table va array pl sql record percentage row type percentage type all these things we are going to learn after that we are going to learn about the cursor we are going to learn about the parameterized cursor we are going to learn about the cursor for loop we are going to learn about cursor with where current of and for update after that we are going to learn about the exception handling in every chapter i am going to tell you what are the important question i am going to give you the list of the question and i am going to give you the list of 10 to 20 question believe me if you are going to remember the list of 10 to 15 question 20 question you are not going to miss any interviews and all from the database portion you will be like okay kind of stuff i am just going to mention the 10 to 20 question i am going to share with you and if you cannot remember the entire oracle if you are going to learn only the 10 20 questions believe me you are going to be like uh, in every written test or in every interviews and all, you are going to get comfortable with it after this we are going to learn about the procedure we are going to learn about the function we are going to learn about function we are going to learn about package we are going to learn about the stored procedure stored function and stored package please 
We are going to learn about the stored procedure, we are going to learn about the stored function, and we are going to learn about the package. This is the practical thing that everyone to learn, and this is the thing that you need to do as a PL squared developer. And we are going to discuss each and everything of this. The procedure we are going to learn about in mode, out mode, in out mode. We are going to learn about the ref cursor. We are going to learn about the functions. Then we are going to learn about the package. Within the package, we are going to learn about the concept of the overloading and everything we are going to learn. After this, we are going to learn about the trigger. This is the end of the PL SQL portion. Then we have some special topics over there. Like we are talking about the partitions. We are talking about the temporary table. We are talking about the log. Log. We are talking about how we can take the backup and uh, recovery. Recovery. We are also going to learn about the few DA command. As a database, as a database user, you should be familiar with this. So this is the entire topic that we are going to cover. All these topics we are going to cover. I am not going to provide you any ready-made kind of PPT and everything. In this way, I am going to write and you are going to get the notes. And every after every session, you people are going to get the notes and recording and everything will be there. What you need to do? You just need to, like, this is the weekend session. So we have the session on Saturday and Sunday only. So you people are going to get the enough time to do the practice. You people are going to get the enough time to do the practice. And what I will do, like I will create a separate WhatsApp group. In that WhatsApp group, always I will be available. If you are going to face any problem, you can text me and I'm going to give you the answer of all these problems and all. So this is the entire process we have. This is the entire process we have. I'm going to share the interview questions with you. I'm also going to share the resume samples and all. So like, uh, as a PL SQL developer, if you need to join any company, what are the things you need to do? I am also going to guide you. But once, one thing is sure, like if you people are going to do the entire session properly in the database, so that you are not going to get any problems. But only the thing is that you need to be honest. You need to be honest. I am going to take the entire session. Recording will be there. You need to do some practice and all. And then only you can get the advantage of the entire session got my point so this is all from my side any question that you people would like to discuss with me any questions any queries from your side that you people would like to discuss with me yes please anyone having any question any queries from your side that you like to discuss with me Yeah, anyone having any questions, please? Because this particular session is for that only. If you have any concern, if you have any queries, we can discuss about that. So further we can continue with the session. So anyone having any questions, any queries from your side? Hello, sir. <coughs> yeah, yeah. Hello. Yeah, regarding any performance uh, tuning queries, how to tune the query and... Uh, how to find out the performance issues, bottlenecks? Yeah, that's the good question. What you are talking about, you are talking about the performance and everything. Remember, yeah. performance is a kind of thing that when you started from the beginning, with every particular command, the performance issues are there. And that need to take care. That's why we are going to discuss about the partition. That's why we are going to discuss about the indexing. And with every command we have the partition, like the performance issues, that we are going to address over there. We don't have any specific session related with only the performance tuning. Got my point? With every particular topic, the performance part is there. And that's links that we are going to discuss about that. The query optimization, the performance, everything we are going to discuss about that. Got my point? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah.
yeah anyone having any questions any queries from your side we have more also the session at the same time uh, i will update i will update let me complete this session first then i will update about the time and definitely like our session will be and we will try to keep the session in the morning itself it might be like i will update you in the advance i will update you today night i will update you like tomorrow we have the session so i will update you the time and everything anyone having any concern any queries from your side so we can solve that questions and further we will continue with the sessions and yeah shomya rahul mahesh majid how are you everything is good yeah yeah good sir yes santosh good yes sir good okay so i think like you people don't have any questions and all so we will continue with this session from tomorrow that will be the first session and there we will start with what is database and about the oracle installation and configuration everything we will start most probably our timing will be like it might be from like uh, i will update your time in the like uh, in the advance i will update you the time it's not like half an hour before like well advance you will get the, about the time and saturday sunday we are going to continue the session saturday mostly our session will be in the second half sunday mostly our session will be in the first half so you people are also going to be free because it's a sunday i can understand as a professional we need to manage the time so saturday we have the session in the second half and sunday we have the session in the first half so i will update you about the times in it's okay yeah 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 rahul message per oh, perfect uh, yes, okay. okay so i am going to wind up this session now today for today like today my agenda was just this to discuss about the course content the road map what we are going to cover and all what will be the process what will be the fee and everything and tomorrow we will start with the session at the same I I will update you that time. Okay. Thank you so much. Thanks for joining. Thank you. Okay. Thank, thank you. you. Okay. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you.